Alright, hello everybody, my name is Jericho, and welcome to Receiver. This is a first person, it's more of a gun simulator than anything else. Oh crap, what was that? Oh, there's a drone out there. Uh, but yeah, if I press, c uh, <coughs> excuse me, hang there for a second. Um, as you can see now, um, on the right side of the screen, you have look, move, jump, Fire weapon, aim weapon, and holster weapon, pullback, slide. Uh, so yeah, you have to do everything you will with a real gun on here. Uh, I can check if there's a round in the magazine by pressing T, or holding T and pressing R. And basically you have to go around and you have to go find, uh, there is 11 tapes. So I'm going to, since I just found some bullets, I'm going to put my weapon away. I'm going to put the bullets in the magazine, pull my weapon back out by pressing the tilde button or whatever that's called. I think that's right. I don't know. It's something Spanish. And then putting it back in there by pressing Z. And this game is basically like 95% muscle memory to be good at it. I've got quite a bit of time played on here. So I'm all right. There's a kill drone down there. Oh dear Lord. Can I hit it from here? Can I hit it from here? These are kill drones as the game calls them. I got it. Uh, they have weak points and stuff, and the tapes tell you their weak points. Uh, I'm just going to point them out here. There's the little area where it spins, where I hit it. There's the back, and then there's the camera on the front and the gun turret. If you shoot the gun turret, the turret will stay alive, but it cannot shoot you. Be careful when doing that, and make sure you have uh, taken it out, or else you will die. Uh, you die in one shot. So the game is relatively hard. Uh, every once in a while it does a little loading skip like that. And you can tell if there's a turret in the area by it, it gives off a blue light like that. Uh, I did not mean to pr do that, so I'll just put my put my magazine back in my gun. And... Oh, there was one around the corner. Dang it. So, yeah, this is... This game... The gun mechanics in this game basically put put to shame every other first person shooter's gun mechanics. So I press R and T. That's how I got around in, my ch in the chamber. Um, as you can see, I've got a different weapon now. Uh, I have the. I'll press that. You get a better view while it's uh, holstered. I use air quotes there. Um, I've got the Colt 1911 right now. Last time I had a Glock 17. That was like modified. It has fully automatic, the Glock does, but uh, you don't really want it on here. Because you're limited on ammo, and uh, yeah, you have to hit them in specific places, so automatic's not the best. Uh, and then you have a, you have, I believe, a, a Colt revolver as well. Of some kind. It's either Colt or Smith & Wesson revolver. Uh, if you haven't, <coughs> I'm a bit ill at the moment, so sorry if I cough and everything. Uh, if you haven't figured out, I do actually have quite a bit of firearms training uh, in real life. I was taught to shoot at a very young age by my grandfather. And I have one round left. I do. I need more ammo. Uh, oh, yes. Ammo and a flashlight. Ha ha. So we just... To do this, you press the tilde to put your weapon away. And then you press Z to put the rounds in the chamber. And then you press... You press R. No. No. Like I said, this is this is all muscle memory. And I'm trying to do this as much without the help as possible. So it's, it's Z to put it back in. Yes, I figured it out. And now I need to... That didn't chamber all the way. If you just like tap it, it doesn't work. You have to hold down R, make sure the slides all the way back before you release. But yeah, I do have quite a bit. I am a 13 year target marksman this year. It's either 13 or 14 this year. I can't remember exactly which one. It might be f no, and 15 is too long. I think it's 13. But yeah, I have a lot of experience with guns and for those of you who might not have figured it out from my accent and the fact that I know how to use guns guns a lot I do live in America and I do live in the south oh crap wait for that it'll make that little ding noise 
that the killbots when they see you they'll turn over there for a minute and if you get behind cover and wait a second then uh you will they'll eventually turn and look away from you i just realized i forgot to turn my timer on so this episode is going to be probably either longer or shorter than most i'm not exactly sure let's see if you hear my breathing i'm sorry Hey, by the way, I just noticed that because the audio program I've got just spiked when I exhaled. Um, my microphone is quite terrible at the moment. Oh, crap, this drove. Man, I died. <coughs> but, yeah. Uh, let's see, we got the cult again. You press Q and you will keep the weapon up. My earphones are beginning to hurt me because I've been playing War Z for some time with uh, Ace Main. Oh yeah, he has a YouTube channel now. Go subscribe to him. There's a... Uh, in my featured channels on here, uh, there's his channel. He just released a video of Terraria. Go watch it. Uh, I picked up... There it is. Yes, this is the tape. It's got a plot that I if you want to listen to it, it's it's got a really unique take on uh, social media and stuff. At least that's what I think it means. But yeah, the tapes, the tapes will teach you how to play the game. If you care to find them all. I've never found them all, so I don't know what happens when you do. Okay... Oh crap, it didn't die. It just took a magazine. Hmm. Let's put that down there. Uh huh, but it's got a really interesting take on social media and stuff. And while I'm not a big social media person, I mainly use Twitter. Uh, oh yeah, I have that too. There's a link to that on my new channel. One channel design, which is pretty bland because I haven't got a background for it yet. I'll probably find something. Uh, if you would like to give me a background for my channel or design me a new logo because the one that I have right now sucks horribly, uh, yeah, that would be much appreciated and I will thank you for it and come find you and give you a hug. Okay, I probably won't come find you and hug you. I'm not much of a hugger. Let's check my ammo. Uh, okay, so I got two rounds left. I can kill a kill drone in two rounds. Um, I I really don't try and find the tapes as much. Uh, I do try and I I try and see how many kill drones I can kill before uh, eventually being killed myself. Uh, the max I ever got was twelve. So yeah. Oh, what is this over here? Is it a tape? Another flashlight and some ammunition. That's a good thing. I'm going to... One of the smart things... Sorry for the silence there for a minute. I just kind of zoned out. Um, one of the things you want to do on here, as with most games, is you you can pick up your ammunition back, but if you, like, take out a map uh, mag and dump it, you don't keep the ammunition, which is a tactic that I just... I love it. Because that's, that's the way it is in real life, and I love realistic games. So I think if you're going to play a game, you want to... You really want to get into it in, a, in order to enjoy it. I almost said enable, but that's not quite right. Pick some of those rounds up. I'm actually, this is, I've lasted pretty long here, haven't I? It's been in... I don't know. Uh, there's a loading time. There's a kill drone. Kill it! Die. Die. Stay dead. Put that back in there. I always... I make a habit of checking to make sure there's a round in the chamber. I don't remember if I said this, but you hold down T and press R like you were going to rack the slide. 
to check and see if there's a round. I just figured that out trying to play the games, and it's it's really useful for everything. Uh, let's see. Go around this corner. Da -de -da -de -da. No, nothing. I've I have nothing counting how many kill drones we've got. We found one tape though. At some point in time, I am going to. What the heck? Okay. That was weird. My keyboard just like whacked out on me. He for a second and would not let me move any direction but left. Huh. So okay, this way. This way, no. Um. Is that one working? No, we killed it. Okay. I have like lost my position and bearings. Normally I would jump cut, but I've switched uh, editing softwares and I'm still learning how to uh, use this new one. So I, d I don't want to risk like just butchering the video apart because I actually care what my videos look like in the end. Even if the sound quality sucks. <laughs> So, we've been going on for a little bit, and now, uh, I think after this death, I'm going to go, I'm going to go ahead and call it quits. I can't talk for some reason, but that's nothing new. I can't hardly speak English. That one's dead. Have we killed all the kill drones? That would, that would really surprise me. I doubt that's true. Have we been through here yet? I don't think we have. Let's see here. There are also, I don't know if I've seen one, but there are flying kill drones that scare the crap. They scare the ever-living crap out of me. And I have... They haunt my dreams. I'm lost in some kind of maze, aren't I? Uh, okay, we haven't been here yet. That's good. There's another tape. Some more ammo. And a kill drone. <laughs> Can I put... Fill up another magazine. Yeah, this is the one where it tells you their weakness. Oh, crap. I got it! Hey! I survived! I survived! There's another one up there! You can die! So, now we're, we're gonna be sophisticated with this. We've got one magazine of ammo left. Crack the slide, as we call it down here in the south, and just go. Ah! Well, I knocked it over, but I don't think I killed it. <laughs> Hello, are you dead? Are you dead? Hello, are you dead? Hello. Oh, I shot its weapon, so it can't shoot me. Oh well. I was hope, kind of hoping it would, because that'd be a hilarious end of the video. There's one of the floaty guys. Hey, you missed. That's cool. Uh, I don't have any ammo, so let's let's run for it. Yeah, I died. <laughs> okay, so yeah, <laughs> that was kind of that was not the end I was expecting, but this has been a uh, receiver. It is an amazing game. Uh, it was created for a first person shooter in FPS competition in like a day so uh, for for the time it took to make it it is just it's it's just beautiful i love it um it is currently out on steam for $5 i if you think FPS is to have done guns right you n you need to go play this game it's worth it it's worth the $5 if you like a little challenging game to just play when you're bored this is worth that too um so yeah, if you have, if you've learned, uh, this guy's gonna keep talking. Shut up! I wish there was a way to skip over the tape, hey, because now I can't do my outro, so I'm gonna have to wait. What? The? So I was going to end there, but we found a tape right away, and it won't let me do a. Ah, crap! There's a little flying dude. They, like, zamp you and they scare me. They don't scare me as much as they used to. But, uh, yeah, I'm going to end it off here. 
here. Thank you for watching. That has no ammo. Oh, fine, you can just go away. Uh, thank you for watching. If you've liked the video, hit the like button, and if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. Because we've got a, I've got a lot of new series coming, and this is going to be part of the play series. Um, I'm recording this before the first episode of the plays a series goes out, so yeah, I feel like I should say that. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for watching, and uh, feel free to subscribe. Uh, more series with is uh, Ace Main. His channel's listed under his real name of Chance White. So go check him out, and uh, yeah, ta-ta for now. Goodbye.